I like the teachers. Friends? My friends are really loving and they don't judge me. There's no popularity system like there is in a lot of public schools. I really like how my teachers teach me how to read. Mr. Goodnight, the science guy. We learn how to share emotions, we learn how to properly deal with emotions, and that's definitely one of the best things about Vanguard. She's sweet, but you don't need to tell someone. I hear it, Vanguard. Here at Vanguard, our philosophy is to treat the whole child, not just the academic piece of the pie, but social, emotional, as well as the academic. I always feel like we should have a big banner up at the front that says we get it, because not only do we understand the kids, but we understand the parents, and we understand the, the family as a whole, and um, there's such a, a sense of acceptance here. As an individual, I think it's really important to see how I've changed, and Vanguard has definitely changed me for the better, and it's provided me with, you know, several important skills that in my future, I'll definitely be able to utilize them in order to get further in life. I feel like when parents are new to the school and they come into a classroom, what they find are teachers that are excellent at planning. They do individualized programs for each child. They understand child development, they understand psychosocial and psychological development. We do everything regular teachers have to do without all of the administration overhead. And for that reason, we're able to really uh, meet the challenges that our different learners bring us. We have an environment where we have a small classroom and we have plenty of teachers. So what that allows us to do is get to know our kids. Every curriculum is tailored to the child. Um, the kids get to call us by our name, so we kind of have a, a close relationship. We can build bonds with the kids. Um, we get to have fun with them. We get to set the structure for them. We spend a lot of time with them. I think Vanguard has been fantastic for Frederick because the very small class, we've seen a marked improvement that's been noticed not just by us, but by our family and friends and everyone around, so we're very, very happy. Carter has reached goals that I never thought he would obtain here. They have helped him and me, you know, obtain all these goals. They have helped us set, um, set them and reach them, for sure. I remember walking in here and we said to Rosalind, well, what is your typical diagnosis? Remember that? Mm -hmm. What's your typical diagnosis of your child? She said, we don't have diagnosis. We don't label any child. And we got up out of here saying we're sending our daughter here. Our kids don't work by an instruction manual, so our teachers have to be creative to set them up for success. In our lower school, we have very tiny staff-student ratios, a maximum of 10 children and two teachers. We're very individualized with our instruction. We do reading, math, language arts, science and social studies, and we focus on um, positive social skills as well. From the moment that we interviewed here with Rosalind, um, it was all about Frederick and his individual needs. As students move to the middle school, that is the, the time really when they make the biggest strides towards independence, and sometimes we have to kind of drag them kicking and screaming. Science just lends itself to be hands-on. So the way we do it is we learn a concept, which means we're going to read, we're going to kind of get the specifics and the vocabulary of the concept, and then we're going to figure out a creative way to actually do the concept. We're trying to find a, a pigeon feather. I already drawn a goldfish scale. Focus it in. Ah, there we go. Are you really hungry today? We do a lot of non-traditional things. You know, sometimes we go outside to do English. Sometimes we, you know, go to the movie. Sometimes we go out to eat. We have a cooking class. We make lunch. What day do we make lunch? Tuesdays. Every Tuesday. My favorite lunch is probably the chicken sandwich 
and the probably the chicken taco. There's two aspects that are so wonderful about this program. One is they go to the grocery store and they have to find the items that are on the list to buy that day. That's getting them ready for the future, right there. The other is, she's probably eaten 70 different kinds of ingredients in, in foods that, that she would never have eaten for us. I ate tofu on Tuesday. I know you did, and you shopped for it. Can we make it at home? Uh-huh. <laughs> nice and easy, put the knife right in the middle. Okay, you see, you did it. Oh yes, I did it. It was a little bit stuck. In an effort to collaborate, you know, share your information. In the high school, we have a two-track program. We have a more traditional college prep program. Of those students who have graduated, over 90% of them go on successfully to four-year colleges. You have the opportunity to do dual credit classes, which I'm doing. I'm taking business calculus right now at Brookhaven Community College. And I also have the opportunity to partake in a college readiness class this year since I'm a senior. We also have a work study track. In that program, our students actually own and run four different businesses. We try to make sure that we emphasize life skills, how to count money, how to budget the money if you have a certain job, uh, decide on what job you want to do, how to get along with others, what's appropriate dress, what's you know appropriate language. After graduation, most of those students go to a trade school, some do certificate programs, and then some just go straight into the workforce. You know, I, we have wonderful teachers, but it's really the, the work of the families and the students that get them from point A to point B. When I was in high school, we had a program where we volunteered our time on Wednesdays to choose a different service site. I kind of had the inside track to getting to come in here to Vanguard and work with Ellie and her school, and it was, uh, it was just a really neat experience. Watching them grow, whether it's with their friends socially or it's learning to do a new math problem, and it was definitely life-changing. Vanguard is special and um, I, I, I believe that in my heart. I, I tell people that all you have to really do is, is to be here. If you have the ability to um, to come and observe your child or just to, you know volunteer and hang out for a little bit to see the kids interact with each other is amazing. I'm most proud of the success of our students. They go on to do wonderful things. The teachers, the therapist, and myself really feel like we are part of a family. You know, the unspoken message to the child is you are really valuable. The opportunity to find the right fit here is really, really positive for a lot of people. In this school, I can't I can't say enough about it. It's done, it's exceeded our goals in every way. I had no idea a place like this existed. I love Vanguard. We love Vanguard. Go Vikings. Go Vikings. Go Vikings.